Let's see what ChatGPT comes up with when I ask it to write a Deadpool 3 movie. We don't know much about the movie except that Wolverine is in it. The AI is free to come up with all other ideas itself. Here we go. The bustling streets of a gritty city serve as the backdrop for Deadpool's latest escapade. Dressed in his signature red suit, he saunters through the chaos with a devil make your attitude, wisecracks rolling off his tongue. Unbeknownst to him, Wolverine works in the shadows, observing Deadpool's every move with a mixture of annoyance and intrigue. As Deadpool finds himself cornered by a group of armed thugs, Wolverine leaps into action with his retractable adamantium claws slicing through the air. He dispatches the assailants with ruthless efficiency, leaving Deadpool bewildered but grateful. Wolverine! I didn't know you were stalking me, bub! Deadpool quips, holding up his hands in mock surrender. But hey, thanks for the assist. You really know how to crash a party. Wolverine grunts, his stern expression revealing little amusement. Don't get any ideas, Deadpool. I was only here for my own business. But if you're involved in something bigger, I might be willing to tolerate your presence. For now. Deadpool's eyes light up with excitement. Oh, it's always something bigger, my Claude friend. Right now, we're talking about an artifact with the power to turn back time. And guess who's after it? Some cosmic time-manipulating villain named Kronos. So what do you say, Wooly? Let's give him a run for his money and have ourselves a bloody good time. Wolverine grumbles, his reluctance evident, but ultimately agrees. Fine, but don't expect any heartfelt bonding moments or sappy team-ups. This is strictly business. We retrieve the artifact, stop Kronos, and go our separate ways. Clear? Crystal. Deadpool replies, grinning from ear to ear. But hey, let's make a deal. If we make it out of this mess alive, we'll share a chimichanga feast. My treat, it'll be a match made in mutant heaven. Wolverine rolls his eyes, the smallest hand of a smile tugging at the corners of his rugged face. Fine, but it better be the best damn chimichangas I've ever had. As Deadpool and Wolverine reluctantly team up, they find themselves on a mission to retrieve a crucial clue about the whereabouts of the Infinity Chronometer. The trail leads them to an underground facility where they once endured painful experiments as part of the Weapon X program. Walking through the dimly lit corridors, memories flood back for both Wade and Logan. Deadpool, known for his snarky humor, tries to defuse the tension with his trademark wit. Hey, remember that time they sewed my mouth shut, Logan? Good times, huh? Wolverine responds with a glare, his memories of the painful procedure still fresh in his mind. The duo cautiously navigates through the facility, encountering remnants of their past tormentors. Deadpool's reckless behavior clashes with Wolverine's no-nonsense approach, creating a dynamic fueled by equal parts annoyance and camaraderie. As they search the facility, Deadpool turns to Wolverine with a hint of genuine concern in his eyes. Look, Logan, I know we've had our differences, but we've both experienced this hell. We're not just lab rats or freaks, we're survivors, and I won't let anyone else go through what we did. Wolverine, though reluctant to show it, acknowledges Deadpool's words with a nod. As Deadpool and Wolverine follow the trail of clues, they eventually locate a hidden lab in the Infinity Chronometer. The lab is filled with remnants of Kronos experiments and arcane machinery, attesting to the villain's twisted mastery of time manipulation. However, as they discover the chronometer's final destination, a realization dawns upon them. It has been used by Kronos to travel to the year 2045, a future rife with uncertainty and chaos. Determined to confront their foe and set things right, Wolverine calls upon the brilliant mutant scientist, Beast, known for his genius intellect and expertise in advanced technology. Together, they embark on the challenge of constructing a new chronometer, aiming to unravel the mysteries of Chrono's plan and restore balance to the disrupted timeline. Beast's tireless efforts pay off as he successfully builds the intricate device, sparking a glimmer of hope for Deadpool and Wolverine in a mission to confront Kronos and save the future from his nefarious grip. With the coordinates set on the chronometer, Deadpool and Wolverine activate the device, causing a blinding flash of light that transports them to a bustling city in the year 2045. Neon signs and flying cars fill the sky, showcasing a futuristic metropolis overrun by crime syndicates and cybernetic mercenaries. They encounter a group of cyber-enhanced thugs sent by Kronos to eliminate them. Deadpool, armed with dual pistols, unleashes a barrage of bullets and quips, while Wolverine's adamantium claws slice through their robotic adversaries. As they progress, they come across an underground resistance movement fighting against the tyrannical rule of a powerful crime lord. The rebels, impressed by Deadpool and Wolverine's skills, share their knowledge of Kronos' plans. They reveal that Kronos aims to exploit the chronometer's time-altering capabilities to establish an iron grip over the entire city. 
Deadpool and Wolverine infiltrate Kronos' high-tech stronghold, battling their way through waves of heavily armed guards and automated defenses. With Deadpool's agility and Wolverine's ferocity, they carve a path towards Kronos' inner sanctum. Finally, they confront Kronos, a maniacal figure draped in a futuristic suit that pulsates with temporal energy. Kronos reveals his true intentions, to create a dystopian future where mutants are eradicated, rewriting history to suit his twisted vision. In a climactic battle against Kronos and his forces, Deadpool and Wolverine find themselves outnumbered and outmatched. Just as it seems like all hope is lost, Deadpool breaks the fourth wall, reaching out to the audience with a mischievous grin. Hey folks, I know what you're thinking. Deadpool says, pausing the action around him. Why fight alone when we can have a little help from some alternate versions of ourselves? Suddenly, portals open up, and alternate versions of Deadpool and Wolverine from different dimensions step through. There's Lady Deadpool, Kidpool, Dogpool, and even a noir version of Wolverine. The battlefield is flooded with red and black suits, claws, and outrageous banter. A shimmering portal appears, and out steps Beast, his agile form bounding with grace and strength. He wears a determined expression as he announces, I was able to get the reinforcements you requested. With a knowing glint in his eyes, Beast points to the infinity chronometer he holds in his hands. There's a lot this device can do, and it's going to turn the tide of this battle in our favor. As the battle reaches its climax, Deadpool and Wolverine make their way to Kronos, who stands at the heart of the chaos. With a joint effort, they unleash a devastating combination attack, overwhelming Kronos and disrupting his time-manipulating powers. Kronos is left weakened and vulnerable, and Deadpool seizes the opportunity. Breaking the fourth wall once more, he addresses the audience directly. This is it, folks. Time for the grand finale. With a final strike, they incapacitate Kronos, ending his reign of chaos and ensuring the safety of the timeline. As the dust settles from their final battle against Kronos, Deadpool and Wolverine stand amidst the wreckage, breathing heavily. The artifact, the Infinity Chronometer, lies dormant at their feet. They exchange a knowing glance, a silent acknowledgement of the camaraderie they've forged throughout their chaotic journey. The unexpected allies bid farewell to their alternate versions, watching as the portals close behind them. Deadpool breaks the silence with a smirk. Well, Wolvie, that was a blast. Literally, can you believe we actually saved the world? Wolverine grunts in response, a mix of exhaustion and satisfaction etched on his face. Hmm. Don't get too excited, Deadpool. We just did what we had to do. Deadpool rolls his eyes. Oh, come on, Logan. Loosen up a bit. We're heroes. Time-traveling, wise-cracking, badass heroes. Wolverine cracks a faint smile, unable to hide his appreciation for Deadpool's irreverence. You're something, Deadpool. That's for sure. As they part ways, Wolverine nods towards Deadpool. Stay out of trouble, Wade. I'm counting on you to keep things interesting. Deadpool salutes mockingly, his signature mask hiding any genuine sentiment. You got it, bub. And hey, if you ever need a sidekick or someone to make you laugh, I'm just a phone call away. With a snicker, Deadpool fades away into the shadows, leaving Wolverine alone with his thoughts. As he reflects on their unlikely alliance and the impact they've had on each other, he can't help but feel a sense of gratitude for Deadpool's unyielding spirit.